How could you say such a thing? What is wrong with what I've just said? Everything. Everything is wrong with what you said. Because I have drummed it into your ears that neither of you should ever set foot in that village again. In fact, you shouldn't have conceived that idea in your mind. But we can't stay in Enugu forever. Look, mom, I am a man now. And there comes a time in a man's life when he must find his root. I would rather, I would rather kill myself than allow any of you to have anything to do with that village again. I barely survived burying your father. I will not survive burying any of you. Mom, please. Who's talking about going to the village to get killed here? I was a child when we left Amimo. What I am saying is that I need to know my kinsmen. Amimo remains the only place in the whole wide world where my unborn children and I would never be known as strangers or sojourners. Exactly, Mom. I mean, Mom, it's so if Okezi and I decide to get married tomorrow, you are saying we will not have to go to the village to do my traditional marriage ceremony? It could be that the person is your friend or a foe that had known you or followed your previous life. Deep words. But I still won't be scared of searching until that one who is destined to know so much about me has come to make me behold the wonders of Chuakike and drink of the beauty of the earth. I will still see with this my eyes even if it is just for a short while. And then I will gladly join my ancestors. Mwokika On something to be clouds the horizon. Don't forget the hawk that catches the chicken that comes from the sky. Mm, is that not why the chicken does not fail to look up when it is either eating or drinking? <laughs> okay, you are such a good man. I wish I could have done more for you. Okotabara, mm. your late father, my dear friend, would be very proud of the wisdom you exude now. Oh. Mm, thanks for your words of caution. Unlike the Ijele masquerade, I will have my eyes, my eyes on the ground to dictate my footsteps. <laughs> Dalo, Dalo. No, no, no. Hmm? Ah! I heard what happened. 
Yes. Dr. Femi, that little girl was not supposed to die. I have had the situation under control for a long time. For her to die just like that. I've never lost a patient. It hurts. I can't... Claire, there's always a first time for a doctor to lose a patient. It's unfortunate though, but rest assured you did your best. You should avoid getting upset about it, okay? Yeah. Thank you, ma. But you need to see that from a different light to make it more positive. Just to avoid the psychological distress. Okay. Yeah. Oh, doctor. Yeah. How do you do? Wonderful. Um, nurse. Where is Doctor Limba? I saw how about the doctor is there. Okay. Udemwa. Udemwa. Who are you? What, what did you just call me? Your name has never changed. It has always been Udemwa. That's not my name, sir. I know they call you Claire, but that is not your name. You still have your kind and generous heart. And your beauty has not left you. Okay, you obviously have the wrong person here. I have to go. I don't need to see the birthmark that has always marveled you for me to ascertain who you are. If the child at the place where you heal people had held on a little longer, you would have been able to heal her the way you want to understand. Stop blaming yourself for her death. Who are you? I have protected you since you were born. But since time for you to manifest has come, and time for me to rest is almost here, I have come to warn you that he still wants you dead. Stop! Please, 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 just stop it. Okay? What are you talking about? Who, who wants me? Who the hell are you? <laughs> mm. The vulture is indeed a prescient bird. Finally. In five days' time, I am going to celebrate the end of a journey that has taken me through the ages. And your celebration has started just too early. Tawala, what is going on here? This fire is not supposed to die until the ritual is completed. The ritual never began. You were fool. Ugobuzwe. I can still smell her blood and I hunger for it. I personally made sure a cannon struck her dead. How could I have been fooled? The shadow of your time is disappearing real fast. If you don't get me her blood in five days' time, I will come for yours. Hawala. Hawala. Get out! Out! 
Who I am is not important. But you knowing the circumstances of your existence and why you must stay alive at all costs is what matters at the moment. Listen, old man, I've had a very disappointing day. And if... Huh, you know what? I don't have to stand here and listen to your hallucinatory stories. We never met. Okay? Have a nice day. You may leave. But remember that the destiny of a lot of people depends on you and... Hey! Just stop it! What is this? Some kind of joke? Like I said, my time is almost up. However, if you don't fulfill your destiny, you will not live beyond the number of days it takes an egg to hatch. Starting from the day you saw your flower last. Claire, what are you doing? Are you talking to yourself? Me? No, I wasn't talking to myself. Is everything okay? Of course, everything is all right. I was just talking to the man. Didn't you see him? The old, weird looking man. All dressed up in some ancient stuff. He was just right here. Yes. Right here. What? What? Uh, uh, okay, just, just tell him to hold on. I'll, I'll be there in a minute. Alright. Driver, please take me back to the hospital. Now, 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 now. Ebo belu go belu The great Okotawala To what do I owe this visit Aneto No matter how corny a man is his attitude is the mirror when a native doctor offers kula not to the gods, he does not chew it first. From the days of our ancestors, Edibia has been a highly spiritual person with deep knowledge and understanding. The skills to master the authority he has to heal. Edibia is that person that cleanses the wrongs of the land. Aneto. Edibia is that person that directs the course of life and the order of the society. And Eto, you are the opposite of them all. I am here to warn you to change from your evil ways. 
<laughs> Okatawala. I used to think you were one of those who understood the dynamics of change. But it is obvious I was wrong. Let me tell you. If you refuse to adapt to change, you will be left behind. Aneto, I am a true Dibia from the bloodline of great native doctors. I'm telling you authoritatively, you are a disgrace to the holistic and spiritual vocation of being a Dibia Aneto. Hold your peace. Aneto, your practices are detestable to you, boy. The sky god. To Amadio, the thunder god. To Anyang, the sun deity. To Ane, the goddess of earth. And most importantly, to book again, the Almighty God. Ah! Doctor, where is he? Sure. You just called me on phone to say my father was rushed to the hospital, so where is he? See, I was in a taxi going after... Well, I was in a taxi when you called, so where is my dad? I didn't call you, and I don't think your father was brought here. You didn't call me? Hello? Dad? Dad, where are you? How are you today? No, I'm just checking on you. No, nothing serious. Okay, sir. I'll call you back then. All right, bye. Is he all right? Someone called me. I am a guard and I want you to drum it into your thick skull. If you are as wise as you claim, you will kneel. You would kneel and bow before me and learn new ways of making this vocation worth your while. Just like the proverbial answer that overfed itself, forgetting it's only a little bird, challenged each chi to a fight. Aneto, soon, very soon, you will realize that the taste of bitter cola is different from the sweetness of sound to the ear. Aneto, Amimo does not need a full man like you. Yeah. Um, what is it? Why are you looking so... Mom, I've had a terrible... Terrible day. I I boarded a taxi. I stopped on the way. I just wanted to walk and clear my head. It's Claire. Yeah. I don't understand it. What is going on, Claire? What? I'm just nothing really. I need to freshen up, Mom. Okay. Mom. Okay. Well. What is the problem? Was it clear you were talking to? It's clear. What is the matter? I don't understand it. She came back looking so unkept. Unkept? She took a taxi, stopped on the road, wants to clear. I don't understand it. Something is wrong somewhere. I do not have time for stupid mere mortals like you. I see darkness in your soul. Mm. 
Aneto, I will not fight you. The gods have their ways of waging wars. But I tell you, you are fighting with mud. You will never be a winner. Go home and die in peace. Oh my God. He said my flower. That's my period. And the eggs. What is this? Claire, what is going on? Claire. How many days does it take an egg to hatch? 21 days, but could be fewer in some hybrid birds. Why do you ask? What do you know about reincarnation? Reincarnation? Well, according to Igbo cosmology, People reincarnate either to complete the good works they started or to receive justice for the wrongs they did when they were alive. However, those that lived a good life join the League of Ancestors. Okay, that's it. Yeah. Do you think I'm... Um Reincarnation of someone else. Would you stop these weird questions? What is this all about? <sighs> if it takes an egg 21 days to hatch, and I just saw my period 16 days ago, that means I have five days. The old man says I have five days to live. Claire, are you alright? In five days, you should be celebrating your birthday and not your death. By the way, who is this old man you keep referring to? Claire! your daughter. This is not the time to sit in self-pity and mourn. If you like, we 
from mountain and until he becomes a mountain. Amaka will never come back to life again. Mkonya, please tell me. Tell me why Mponani should kill my only child. Why should I wash my hands? Only to crack pan canes for chickens. Why? You are asking the right <laughs> questions. Unfortunately, you are expecting answers from the wrong person. What have I done to deserve all this? I know you need answers. That is why I have come. <laughs> If you are a human, you should be scared of me. If you are a spirit, Aneto is not afraid of you. Show yourself. Rico, that is what you want. You want us to eat together. Mm -mm. I will not allow that to befall me. Clear. Look at me. Emeka and I have tried to make a meaning out of what you are saying. Okize has been here for hours over the same issue. All to no avail. Why can't you make it simple for all of us to understand what is going on? Mm. Mom, how else am I supposed to do that? Relate to me in a way that I will understand. I am your mother. Make me understand. Okay, they said you were talking to yourself. And you told me a few minutes ago that you were talking to an old man. How do I relate to these two things? I don't know. I need to find out myself. Okay. okay. If it is about the patient which you lost at the hospital, mm. I will be coming sick over. Mom, the... I'm a doctor. Okay? If I was sick, I would have known. Hey, she never can. Okay, Zia. I am seriously worried about a lot of things right now. First, I am worried about Claire and her preposterous story. And secondly, I am worried about the fact that for 25 solid years, I have not set my foot in my hometown. I mean, cannot to worry, okay? You see, Claire will soon get over hers. And as for you, I understand it's, um... No, you, can't. you do not understand. I am seriously thinking about getting married. And my mom thinks that getting to know my people is one issue that shouldn't be brought up at all. Look, that is something that I cannot swallow hook, line, and sinker. <laughs> so, I mean, you have your options. Take the decisions, man. My problem is this. What if I go to Amimo? And my mother goes ahead to carry out her threat of killing herself. Now let me tell you something about mothers. See, mothers are almost always stronger than they would want you to imagine. But the truth is that, yes, most times they, they tend to be right about certain decisions. But in situations like this, my friend, ignore them and take the bull by the horns. 
And what if I go to Amimo? And circumstances prove her right. Okay. And what if you go to Amimo and your people welcome you with open arms? Oh. oh. <laughs> you see? <sighs> okay, Zia. I am having a difficult time here and you are not helping matters at all. How do you mean? Look. I am talking about finding my route, building a house there if need be. All I need from you is to tell me not to go or come out straight and tell me, yeah, that that is the way to go. Like, 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 seriously, you, you want somebody else to take your decisions for you? Come on, man. You're bigger than this, man. <sighs> As I'm sitting on the case, when as I'm Ned, go do good day. As a nigh Adam, and the work and the wine do a lundibo. That's been a million down of the name one. Sino Cadica, I bear belly. Idi uno bial, oya dero uno mo. Idi uno bial, oya meli e uno. What's that? Very apple. Oh, yeah. I'm not going to get in, get the other, get the other, and mirror. See, I'm not going to go to the other. I'm going to go to the other. I'm going to be a photo. Even I'm going to do it. I'm going to go to the other. Give a little need a la channel fair. I am made on only a do ever talk for mob. Um, on your decker. I can't go to quarter. Going to? I am going to Enugu. Enugu. Don't you think you're supposed to be at home morning? If I know. I know that I am supposed to be at home morning, my daughter. But if I told you how I lost my coat, you would elect to replace it for me. I am going. It's all right. Go well, Lo. Hey, this life. Now that she has succeeded in killing everybody in her family, she wants to run away. Each time we walk past that man's house, I can't help but wonder how evil some people can shamelessly be. My brother, I still believe in the tenets of our people that says, Nkonye metara, What? So ever evil that a man saw it, that shall hear it. Exactly. Just as Onyedika is sweeping house, can't you see how her only daughter, her Otunwa, just died off? You know, sometimes eh, I wonder the mystery behind the death of that girl. How can you tell me that a cannon that was meant to dent? The skies turned around, struck that girl dead. Huh? What could have been the evil that that girl committed? Just negotiate, just negotiate. The only huh? evil she committed is having a wicked girl ah. that killed her husband in a mysterious 
kill her ah, husband's sh- other brother and used charm to make his wife and children disappear from this village and never to return. You are saying? Mm-hmm. Why don't you concentrate on the content of this bottle and forget about what I want? Forget. I remember now. Mm-hmm. See, see. Hmm? Let me just tell you one thing. Eh? I was not there when it happened though. But I can remember vividly that woman eh, denying that she has no hand in all those things that happened. You understand? Mm-hmm. Huh? I know. She can deny you. But the truth remains. No matter how long it takes, Annie, wait for Annie. Annie will never fail to pay back evil to evil ones. I wish your prayers will be answered. Let the evil ones go so that the good ones like us will stay. Eh? I will. My drink is finished. <laughs> but meanwhile, I go. Don't you think I, I still have to get another for the night? It should just be good. It is finished. Yes, my God, it is finished. See, may this or the content of this bottle not take you to your early grave as you are prescribing for others. Yes, yes, yes. I do. I do. wait for my daughter. I do. You. She has taken the path of the guilty minded and has gone on self-exile. I have sealed this compound. Henceforth, no descendant of Dimba shall ever lay claim to this property. And no human will ever walk into this compound and leave to tell the story. Aneto has spoken. Tell me nothing. See, if it's about the little girl that died, who all told you it's not your fault? You shouldn't allow that affair. I it. just told you not. Listen, I told you something yesterday. You didn't believe me. What else do you want me to do? Claire, I love you. And I should be worried when you begin to behave like, like you're something that's... Like what? Like I'm crazy, right? Now I'm in case of paranoia. Just say it. Just say it. Claire, you need to calm down. Don't tell me to calm down. Please. I need to see that old man. I have questions and I need answers. Huh? What? Why are you looking at me like that? Nothing is wrong with me, okay? Okay, just called me now. He said that Claire is going crazy. What? What's going on here? Did you go to Enugu yesterday? Or you came back this morning? Did you find them? Where did I go wrong? What have I done? Who did I offend? Onye Dika, how many times do I have to tell you that crying does not solve problems? By the way, what, why are you here in the village? Instead of looking for Cynthia and her children in Enugu, I so quite instructed. 
We were attacked by armed robbers. What? They took everything from us. I slept in the bush. Hmm. Only God knows how I begged my way out to this place. <sighs> Only to find out that Aneto has condoned off my compound. How much suffering am I supposed to take? It's okay, Nyedeke. It's okay. Let's go to my house and think of something else to do. Huh? I cried. Then <gasps> Oguafa asked me if my hands were clean. <sighs> because I know that I did nothing wrong. Was he not the one that asked me to go to him? <laughs> to see Cynthia and her children and make peace with them. <sighs> I left Enugu only for Neto to come and do this to my compound. <laughs> God will punish Aneto. Aneto will die like a fowl. It's okay. He will tell Abimo what I've done to deserve. It's it. okay. Mm? It's okay. <laughs> he will not know peace. Ah! No more. Let's get out of here. Please, let's go. I don't know you will not die well. It's okay. It's okay. Let's go. Let's go. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You have been looking for me. Yes. I have. You know the reason I'm locked in here? I was talking to you outside and okay, they thought I was talking to myself. Who are you? Why are you doing this to me? You don't have much time left. Pull yourself together and stop asking the wrong questions. You must think this is a joke, right? You must think this is some kind of game. I need to know what is going on. And I need answers now! I have just very short time to guide and protect you. Beyond that, your life and death is up to your decision. Stop this madness! Stop it! Your father has the answer to all your questions. My father is dead. Okay? I was barely a year old when he died. You died before your father. <sighs> if you could ask questions, he could have answers. <laughs> oh, this is just great. I died before my father. Really? Okay, this is it. Old man, I am done with you. Go back to where you're coming from and stop watching me. I never asked for this. What? If you stay here a little longer, you end up where they keep my people. It's certainly not a worthy experience. Udemwa, are you ready to embrace your destiny or not? Where's my daughter? Oh, I just calm down. She's contained. There's no need to panic yet. We'll just do some tests, you know. Doctor? Yes. Yeah. Dr. Dimba has started talking to herself again. Screaming, actually. Where's the key? The key is full of My daughter! Claire! Where's Claire? Please! Take me to where she is! Okay, Z, I, I, I personally locked her in here. Huh. Faith! Faith! Yes, Doctor. Where is she? I saw her here before coming to tell you. Okay, Z, mm -hmm. are you sure this nurse did not open this door for her to escape? No! I, I have the keys. Okay, Z. If I don't see clear, in the next few minutes, I am going to turn this hospital upside down. As for you, this nurse, I'm going to kill you with my bed. No, 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 I 
I'm a doctor. Okay? A medical doctor. Jesus. Judging from what you're wearing and the things you're saying, I doubt if you understand any what I just said. But get this into your ancient score. I... People will think that you are crazy when they see that you are talking to no one. The look on that man's face says it all. Why me? Why me? How did I let you talk me to come into this place? You have four days to set things right. If you die, Amimo will suffer devastating consequences. Set what's right? Huh? What are you talking about? Okay. Fine. Someone is trying to kill me, right? You, spirits, ghosts, magic man, whatever it is you call yourself. You couldn't stop them. How am I supposed to? Oh. oh. Is it, is it I'm going to die in four days or someone? I mean, this person you're talking about is trying to kill me. This is where my journey into Amimo ends. Oh. joke is this okay fine i'm sorry okay just come back now hello what kind of game is this come here how can this man bring me here just go man warrior god knows i will strangle you if anything should happen to my daughter Mom, calm down. You need to relax. Relax? You said I should relax? When this dummy here was supposed to take care of my daughter, Kelly. But he and his stupid nurse, Eliza, allowed my daughter to disappear into thin air. And you were there telling me to relax. I should relax indeed. But, Okizia, okay, are you saying that no member of your staff saw her leave the hospital? I have asked questions. Emeka, you saw me go around asking questions in the hospital, but nobody saw her. I even had help locking her up. I, I don't just... Shut up your mouth! Close your mouth. Just shut up and let me talk. Nonsense! Emeka, we are going to report this to the police. I am not taking any chances. The girl we are talking about is my only daughter. Am I clear? She just sent a text message now. A text message? She has gone to Amimo. <laughs> Mom! Mom! This is Zimba's compound. And I don't think you should cross that yellow pan front. In fact, don't walk into that compound. Why? A very powerful native doctor puts that thing there and anybody that walks into that compound will die. I have to go now. Okay. Thank you. Hey! We leave that thing. Who are you and where do you think you're going? Do you want to die? I'm asking you questions and you think you can ignore me? Why don't you just come inside and introduce yourself properly? Supreme One. Supreme One, your food is served. Yeah, Supreme One, you know you have not eaten anything for a while now. And you know that this world requires good food 
and fresh by one. Yes, so that uh, that's why uh, we prepared good food for you. Do you boys want me to turn you into frogs? But, no, no. Sir. No, sir. Get out of my sight. Attacking Anito. Are you out of your mind, Nkonye? Stay out of this. Stay out of this, Nkonye. Is this how you want to lose everything? Huh? I have nothing else to lose. I am going to kill Anito hey. and then end it all by killing myself. Oh, yeah, oh, you can listen to me. You can live through this. Huh? You can live through this, Sonia oh, yeah, You can't be so cowardly to commit suicide. Don't you dare call me a coward. Don't call me a coward. Look at what Aneto did to my house. You're here calling me a coward. I am going to get that Aneto. Oyanika, Oyanika, listen to me. Oyanika, you know too well that if you get close to Aneto, he will kill you. Oyanika, please. Please listen to me. Let's go back. Oh, Bikonu. Biko, Biko, let's go back. Bikonu. Biko. Let's go back, yo. Aneto. It's okay. Aneto! It's okay, it's okay. Biko, oh. Huh? It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Huh? Where can I find the people that live here? It was very bad. I was asking you questions and you ignored me. Now you want to get answers from me? Why don't you come out of that compound and see if you don't get the answers to the people and slap some punch? You would slap and punch a girl? A man like you? Are you not ashamed? What? Wait. Is this a village thing or you scream at people you've never met before? Enough of that. You're talking to me like that. And I have to give it Who are you? And what are you doing in this compound? Why does everybody in this village bark like dogs? Ha! Day has not been born. When an urchin like you we call Andeto a dog and live to tell the story, ha! You are dead already. What nonsense! Instead of taking me to the village, you brought me to the hospital. Knowing that your sister will be at risk in the village, eh? And not where you able to get on the phone? No, her phone is still not reachable. But you need to rest, mom. What dumb advice are you giving to me? Take me to the village right away. All right, I will take you to the village. But first of all, we have to get back home and get some spare clothes. If you don't take me to the village right now, I will personally walk myself to that village. Please, if you're done with your empty threats, can you please let me know where the people that live here are? Ugobuzo. Ugenwa. Ugo!
You wouldn't believe the spectacle I just witnessed in your compound. Eh? It is better experience than told. Hi! An ordinary girl. Hi! Eh? Is it not obvious that she's not in the mood for that your stupid drama right now? Look at this woman though. Eh? I'm telling you that I just saw an ordinary girl walk into, into her compound. With her bare hands, she told your mum and walked inside. It doesn't end there. I saw an A202. I don't know how he got there. I thought Aneto was going to kill this girl, scatter the girl and all that. But to my greatest surprise, it was like a bombshell. The girl struck Aneto down. Why? Straight. What are you talking about? Aneto wanted to attack the girl. But when their two hands struck like this in the air, the sound her head was ten times stronger than that of a thunder. I dodge. Yeah. Hmm? Gobuzo. Hmm? Obviously, you are not drunk. Because your two legs are strong on the ground. But why are you talking as if you are drunk? She's still at the compound. How was that possible? How could you place a bag of salt on my head and still send the brains after me? I have prepared for all my life. Yes, she was hidden from me. But today, I saw her. Yet, you allowed the first opportunity I had of having a dramatic victory to slip off my hands. You are Mrs. Onyedika Dimba, right? Yes. And who are you? My name is Ude. My name is Claire Dimba, the daughter of um, late Madoka Dimba. Claire? <laughs> yes, ma. My daughter? Who call you? Lord is truly thicker than water. Hey! <laughs> I thought calm. Now look at what, what you have caused. If this woman dies, eh, I'll finish you off. Mom, what? Which of these roads will take us to Amimo? <laughs> That's Amimo. That's Amimo there. But I don't think I'll go in with you. Why? Think... Isn't that the reason why we left the hospital in the first place? And you couldn't even allow me to. Mom, you're crying. What's going on? Talk to me, Mom. Mom, what is it? Talk to me. My son, I left Amimo in tears. And with my bare feet on the ground. But I swore that I will never go back there again. And even if I'm forced to return. What, Mom? That I will not live to see the dawn of a new day. Jesus Christ! 
What are we going to do now? I think I've had my fair share in life. I think Claire deserves us. Yeah, she deserves her life. What are you saying? I don't understand you. Just go. Okay? Just go. I should go ahead. Just go. It's going to be okay. Just go. Go. Let's go. Okay? Let's go. Have you people come to dare me? How can mere mortals like us? They're the one who dines and wines with the spirits. And they told you great. We greet you. Mm. What do you want? Late Maduka Dimba's daughter just came home. And out of excitement, she went into the compound with Onyedika. And how does that concern me? Aneto. You never walked into that place in defiance, but out of excitement. So we are here to beg you to please reverse the course you placed on that land. Because it's going to be hey, a very... Hey. Two of you walked into my compound to beg me on behalf of a murderer. But, but nobody has been able to prove that she, she killed the, the, the husband and... Ask the useless drunk to talk before me. If you were fit for sacrifice, I would have offered you to the gods as bond offering. Hey, fool me, fool. Now, two of you, turn around, walk out of my compound. Now! <laughs> Close my gate. Me, he's less drunk. Huh? He even said I'm not fit for sacrifice. Hi, Ubuzatalama. I've never been so insulted in my entire life. Huh? Just Ugo. Ugo, please forget the insult. Lives are at stake here. Onyedeka will put her life on the line just to save another person's own. Let's maybe we should go and report to the king. Who is Aneto, by the way, sir? Eh? Who, who is he? Is it because everyone in this village is, is, is afraid of him? Gobuzo, we should not allow Onyedika and that innocent girl to die. Do you know that after the death of Onyedika's daughter, I personally took her to Okwafa in Enuago for divination. What has Okwafa's divination got to do with all the insults Aneto just heaped on me now? Okay, look at it. Nkoi, have you seen any drink in my hand? Hey, Nkoi, do I look drunk? Okwafa told us that Aneto is responsible for what is happening in Dimba's compound. Mm -mm. Mm. Mm -mm. Mother, you need to eat something. Please, let us eat. I love your spirit, my daughter. But of what use is food to us when every second brings us closer to an enemy to death? And when death finally comes, one needs energy to join into the world beyond. Please, eat something. And it is a wide animal. And I will show him that I am bigger than any sacrifice the gods can get. What are you talking about? And it must reverse that course 
at gunpoint, whether he likes it or not. Oh, look! Look at Look at Stop! 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 Hey! Stop! Didn't you hear me warning you not to drive inside this compound? What is the matter? Why can't I drive into the compound? Look, you are evil. Ask him, evil and evil woman. Anyway, I did not come for you. Claire, what are you doing here in the village? Just look at you. Eating with the same woman who have sworn that she will not rest until she has finished killing all the members of the Dimba family. Eh? Oh, yeah, Dika. So this is your plan. So this is your plan. You use your charm to lure my daughter to the village so that I can kill her. Oma wa kwali yo. Oma wa kwali yo. Asin do ma wa kwali yo. Asin. It's not maka. Ugobuzu, you make so much noise even when you tip toe. Sorry, Papa. I didn't want to disturb your rest. The last time you tip toed into this compound and out, it didn't work well, did it? Papa, you can continue with your rest now. I'll be back very soon. Are you out of your senses? Do you know what your stupidity has cost me and your brother? Do you know what it took us to be here? Claire! Get into that car and let us get out of this place right away! Oh yeah, Dika! Hey, what? Sit there! Oh, so why didn't you want Cynthia not to walk into the compound? I tried to warn them, but they wouldn't listen. Hey! Hey, what? Hey! Claire! Can someone tell us exactly what is going on here? We are all dead. Dead? Anybody who walks into this compound is dead already. Hey! Mom! I'm sorry. I don't think I'll go with you. We are talking of saving lives here. This is a spiritual matter. We don't have the power to interfere. You don't have to chicken out. And it has disturbed and oppressed the people of this community for so long. And inside time, we showed him that we are men like him. Ugo, this is a golden opportunity to teach him a lesson. No matter how strong or tough a man is, he must have a strong fear for a gun. I think. Yes. <laughs> I can go after armed robbers or even kidnappers, but to fight a NATO with a gun? Hmm. Come to think of it. Do you realize what you're getting yourself into? Do you know what you're talking about? Man, you are just fidgeting like just a child. I beg there, there. I'm not surprised. Hello? Hey, Mika, what's going on? I've been trying to reach you and clear on phone, but to no avail. It's clear in the village? Yes. Hey, Mika, what happened? Honestly, okay, Zia. This is the worst journey of my life. Hmm. If I had known that this would be like this, I wouldn't have come to this godforsaken village in the first place. Yes. Well, first thing tomorrow morning, I am coming back to Enugu. However, if you do not see me, just know that we have all died in the village. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> How did you disappear from the hospital and nobody saw you leave? Yes. Where is my father's grave? And what is the useless drunk 
and his little masquerades doing in my house. Aneto, we are not going to stand and watch you waste innocent lives for no just cause. Mm. And what do you intend to do about it? From here, we are marching to Dimba's compound. For you to reverse anything you have done there. And listen, it is either you follow us willingly, or we'll be forced to move you ourselves. I will forgive your ignorance. And allow you the bliss of walking out of my compound with your two legs intact. You lie on it. We are not living here without you. If you don't live with us now, Ugo, shoot him! Ah! Ugo, may if I go here if I can't say about poor now. Just do this and let's go. I let you know one more while you're tempting me. Is it a move now? Yeah. As a mungo go now go go. to tell us what is going on. Give us explanation. What is there to explain to all of you? None of you seems to understand me. What do you mean? That you are a medical doctor does not make you more intelligent than me. Agoma, <laughs> what is it? You told me that uh, you were... See, I was to follow Gobuzu and the other boys to Anito's house. To force him to come and reverse what he has done here. I refused. But I changed my mind. I decided to go to Anito's house. On getting there, I saw Anito cast spell on them. I decided to give it the compound. Eh? Just like that. What is going on? You see, Onyedeka, I lied to Gobuzo. I told him that uh, Okwafa revealed to us that Aneto is uh, responsible for what is happening in your family. You know, he, he went to Aneto to force him to reverse the cause. I think he's in trouble. So you are the cause? What do we do now?
what you have done here is impressive. But what I want to know is what gave you the guts to walk into my den and do this. While you're waiting for that answer, why don't you just watch this? Are you out of your senses? Who are you? Is this how you're supposed to thank me for saving you? Are you aware that if it wasn't because of you, I wouldn't have found myself in that situation? I wouldn't have gone to challenge Aneto or even... Wait. You called him Ugubuzu. I want to know why. Men and your stupid pride. You don't have to thank me. But next time you get in trouble, don't look like Just in the good. Just in the good. Have you seen what you have cost? Do you want me to die? Why do you want to make yourself my problem? You want to make yourself my problem? Is that what you want? I don't consider that girls. I don't want to This is a new one. But there is no problem without a solution. I, Aneto, the one that stands on the ground and counts all the feathers on a flying bird. Then one, now that I have set eyes on you, and I have what you touched, let's see how she is going to survive this one. Let us see. Mom said that she would die if she ever set foot in this village. Claire! Oh God. 
Mom? Gosh. Hey. To bring her inside. Let's take her to the nearest Hey! Oh my god. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, dear. Sorry, sorry. Mom, the car is not starting. Eh? Start it! The car is not starting! Bring that girl out of that car. She's not ready to go. Eh? Stay out of this. Claire, please. Claire, Claire, Claire. Okay, please. Please, please. Help me. Hey. Oh my God. Mom, hold her. Hold okay. her. Okay. That's it. Um, why don't you bring her inside? Huh? Oh, let's, huh? go, let's, okay. go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Mom. Mom. Get it. Get it. Let's go. Let's leave this place. Why? <laughs> I have said it. She is not ready to go. Bring her out. God will Please. punish you for making this wicked statement. God will punish you for making this wicked statement. Anyanika, your evil plan will not work. It will not work, or it will work, not work for you. Anika, what are we going to do? Anika, let us get out of this evil oh, infested place. It's not starting. It will start. It has to start. Anika, Anika, bring her out of the car. The time has come. The time has come for the lily livad to take refuge. I am an Eto. The great river that drowns even the birds of the sky. None was. And none will ever. I bust like the pod of an oil bean. And when my seed strikes, even the elephant embraces the earth in death. The king of Amimu will be my messenger. The people of Amimu and even beyond will be my subjects. And for those who do not bow and tremble before me, my reign of terror has just begun. Huh. Where is Jackie? I don't know where. Is he still there? Is he still there? Up and away we sit with our normal niyala. It is with humility of the knees and elbows to the ground. The kid sucks milk from the breast of a mother goat. You poor kid. I can't the poor child. Our hands are clean. Ane, anebu anebu mbana. The Earth Goddess. You know the good and bad of our footsteps. Hmm. I am still wondering how and when Claire became a herbalist. And now you are telling me... Oh, to be honest with you, everything that you have just said sounds cock and bull to me. How can my father die simply because he ate at a funeral and the food was not poisoned? According to Okwafa, your father didn't die because he ate there. But because of the reason he shouldn't have eaten there. My son, a man does not eat at someone else's father's funeral when he has not performed the funeral rites of his own father. Are you saying that that was just what killed my father? Yes, and the same thing will kill you if you try it. Where is Claire? I said, Where 
is clear. She was here. Yes, I know. But the question is, where is she? Where is she? Huh? Why are they did you tell her where my husband was buried? Huh? Did you? If Ugobuzo I know can for once in his life pace like this, it means he has begun to have meaningful thought about his life. Hey you! What are you doing here? Eh? You've come to find out if I'm dead, right? I'm sorry, I'm not. Now get out of here, get out of here. Can you stop barking like a dog? Now just listen to me. What do you know about that native doctor? Me? Barking like a dog? Let me. Is that it to know for native doctor? I am a medical doctor, a pediatrician, if you understand what that means. Not a native doctor. My daughter, who are you? Oh, this girl is close to. As a matter of fact, she's the reason I am dying by the storm. Papa, don't, don't, don't touch that girl. Papa! Papa, you close. What is all this, man? Eh? What kind of nonsense thing is this? Mm. Where could Claire be? Mm. Where would she be? Eh? How long am I supposed to wear one cloth? Eneka, why didn't you press for that? So I will go home and get clothes. Mom, I mm. wonder why you think I'm having the best of time here. I am actually having it worse. Because I'm not sure if I'll still have a job by the time we get back to Enugu. Why you talk back at me like that? You can't talk to me like that. You slapped me? Yes! You can't dare! Idiot! Mom, I beg you in the name of God, don't make this more unbearable for me. I am leaving this village with or without clear. Erica. Have you seen what your wickedness has caused? Have you seen it? Just look at me, living like a mad woman in this village. I have a comfortable accommodation in England, yet I sleep in the car, simply because I do not want to sleep under the same roof with you. <laughs> it will not be well with you. Enough, Bob. That is enough. What is all this? Shut up your mouth. If Hasham has taken over your mind, tell me that I can slap you more. And set you free from it. Idiot! When the only instrument one has is a hammer, every problem becomes a nail. Cynthia, remove the locks in your eyes so that we're able to see things clearer. Yes. Hey! You slapped me! It's alright, Mom. It's alright, Mom. It's alright. Let me. Leave Mom, her. Me. Oh. Okay, Mom. Hey, Cynthia, what no, is this? She slapped me. It's alright, Mom. What? Yes, I am blind, but I can see you are as confused as a bat in broad daylight. Uh, are you who I think you are? Mm. Mm. Papa, I've warned you, this girl is evil, though. Papa, you can't start to imagine the things that this girl does, though. Eh? Papa, see, this girl can uh, cast spells. And undo them as if it's nothing. As, as, as simple as a hungry child eats Akara in the street. Papa, Papa keep, your, keep, your, keep away from this girl. Oh. She's evil. Sir, I, I wouldn't know who you think I am. From the confusion in your soul, many questions you seek answers to, and what my son just said, I think you are... Uh, uh, you, you, you are the person that I have been waiting for all my life. Papa, how can you say that? Have you seen her before? Have you seen her in this village before? Eh? Papa, had it been you have eyes, I would have said her, 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 her beauty is trying to change you, but she's not even beautiful, sir. Come. There is no time to waste. Come with me. I have to confirm your true identity. 
Go, Buzo. Go, Buzo. Ugo. Take this money. Ugo. Uh -huh. Take this money. Go and get four gallons of raffia pan wine. Ugo. Two gallons of oil pan wine. Ukuenu. Four cola nuts. Five alligator pepper. Eight tubers of yam. Go into my room under my bed. From the box there, get six carry shells. Bring them to Okotabala's house. Let's go. The young see about the ones young. Go and do what I told you. I know him. Have you been able to reach Claire again? Oh, yeah, I have. She's all right now. That's all right. And when is she coming back to work? Very soon. Yeah, very soon. All right. Okay. God. Why haven't I been able to reach any of them on phone? I think I need to get to Amimo right away. Doctor. Yeah. Uh, here is Dr. Clay's phone. You gave it to me that day she was acting strange. Is there any problem? I tell you, you told your son to buy it. He said it's for my own. Ibago. What does that mean? Ibago is a spiritual process through which the identity of a reincarnated person is established in him whose Ibago is being performed. I'm surprised you asked. Reincarnation. Are you really... Apart from that, if you are usually sickly, Ibago is also used to determine how that sickness affected the person that reincarnated in you and how best to treat it. It is also used to provide remedial actions for children that are always stealing, excessively stubborn, and a whole lot of other things. And you can achieve that through this archaic and evil practice? If you can remember the road to a place you have never physically been to in your life, uh, shouldn't we suppose that you are doing it through an archaic and evil practice? Ivo, what are you talking about? We are going to Kotabola's house. I am blind. I'm not directing you. How did you bring us to this place? By the way, how did we get here? Wait. You mean I've been showing you the way? Oh, and the time I'm police, do you know? Huh? You I'm Lead on, let's go to where we are going to before Gobuzo gets to that place before us. Jiden Makano and continue to lead the well. Since you have remembered your living. Is we won't leave here without my daughter. But Claire doesn't want to leave. We have done all we can to get her back to her senses. But she remains unbendable. Let us leave now that we can. I've told you, Emeka, I am not leaving this village without clear. Just do something and get me some food and clothes. Do anything. Get me food. What's wrong get with you clothes. two? What's wrong with you two? We're supposed to be dead. But let someone have stopped it. Can't you see beyond your, your nose that whatever brought her to this village is beyond the physical? Can't you? Uh, 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 please. Go, go. Claire is my daughter. And we need to support her. We need to see her. If you weren't feeling like a peacock hey! and told her where her father was buried, she probably wouldn't be out there looking for it God knows where. For once in your life, Cynthia, stop behaving like you know it all and listen to the voices of people around you. Yes, listen. Leave her alone. Cynthia, go. Go. Oh. 
He is preparing for your email. <clears throat> What did you just say? I said that I am no longer down with this. If you two want to continue fighting, you can go ahead and kill each other. I don't care, and I'm off to Enugu. Emeka, if you drive out of this compound, I will disown you. You will cease to be my son, and I will no longer be your mother. Are you happy now that you have destroyed my family? Ah, hey! Emeka disobeyed me. My son, he disobeyed me. I threatened to disown him. Yes, he blocked me and drove off the Enugu. Oh, yeah, they can thank you. Here, have the clothes. What is it for? We need to go and see the king and report everything that has happened. You don't want to look like this to the palace. And what makes you think I want to go and explain to the king? Your stupid pride. Because, take it! For how long will you continue to play second fiddle when you can actually have the world in your hands? Abala, I need more time. You shouldn't be afraid of the consequences of mother. Sacrificing Udenwa is the least you could do to get what you want. Kill her now and you will cease to be a glorified servant that helps her gather roots and herbs. And you become the most powerful healer the world has ever known. Ugo! Ugo! Ugo, Buzwe! Yeah. <laughs> Anna, <laughs> uh, hmm? Uh, I'm not going to move loose. Did you get Hmm? I'm not going to get Hmm? As an onion, you have a have a good one. You have a good one. You have a good You are from a bloodline of great healer. Roots and half serve and obey your command. You are the one, the daughter of Utijimbolo. I don't understand the thing you just said. My name is Claire. Claire Dumba. I am a medical doctor, a, a, a pediatrician. Do you understand what I just said? Silence, Udewa. Udewa. <laughs> you were young and powerful, but a threat to the one whom you loved. His name was Gobuzwe. What? How could a cock girl like her love you? 
kede biugu na ekwu okwu ebe mu wo kuta agbala wo ku no ha Ugobuzwe never wanted to share the spotlight with anybody even with them whom everybody thought he loved. Ugobuzwe went into a covenant with the dark goddess whom he thought was Abala. Because Abala promised to give him limitless powers for your blood, Ugobuzwe. So, who is this Ugo Buzo? Good question. Greetings. Mm -hmm. Please step out of the way. The king of Omimo is passing. Tell your king to come and kneel and bow before me. What? Are you all right? Did you ask me that? Question? What is going on here? Please. What is going on here? Can't please, you get him out please, of the way? Please bow for me. Please bow. What? Please. Please. Next time you see me walking along the road, you remove your jalopy out of the way. My king, what are you doing? Please stand up. Please stand up. You slapped your You slapped your kid. You slapped your kid. Sorry, you sorry, sorry. How many times am I going to explain to you people? I know nothing about the eyes. I am a pediatrician. I treat children. Udemwa, the problem with people who are spiritually empty because they have lost faith in their belief system is that the only thing they look up to is what they feel they can see, measure, and calculate. Stop living in self denial of who you truly are. Exploit your spirituality. You think I'm spiritually empty? Oh wait, you think I'm self? Fine. Ayara for kwa gulu mata na ka konyo nari amban. Ah. Are you happy now? Are you happy? I mean, I am yet to make sense out of this whole thing. Why I'm here in this village? Here you people are complicating it the more. The old spirits man, whatever he called himself, thought I was going to die in five days. This is the thing. You are as beautiful as your voice. Go on. I can see. Baba, Baba, you can see. Hmm. Is your wife here? Huh? Man, you're here, too. Ganya. Huh? Huh? No. Hey, hey. Maka. 
Where is your sister's corpse? Are you mad? Have you no sense of civility at all? Huh? What is wrong with everybody in this community? You just see somebody and without greetings? You start oh. asking stupid questions. Oh. Excuse me. She said that uh, Aneta just made the king to start eating grass down the road. I'm just minding for her. She's a rumor manga. <laughs> Where is her corpse? Whose corpse? Where is Sudema's corpse? Where is your daughter's corpse? My daughter is not dead. And her name is not Udemwa. If you don't tell me where her corpse is, neither of you will see the light of another day. You don't scare me anymore. Despite all you did to kill us, we are still alive. If you're that powerful, you should know where Claire is. I will find her. And when I do, you will witness the rebirth of Ugobuzo Otake. I will slaughter her in your presence and offer her blood to Abara. Where we're going now? Hey! Hey! What is this now? Please help me. Who are you? not allow me to eat in peace and you will not show yourself are you that scared of me are you that scared of eating with me are you not a god that you fear to die from eating with the spirit of the girl your mother if you don't allow me to eat in peace I will come after you. <laughs> I will never be further from you than a plate of food away. Let's see how much longer you live without food. Ah! Um, Supreme one, you are not eating again. Should we carry the food? 
Let's go and eat the food. Yes! Lunch! I have not eaten in days. You know what to eat. What is wrong with him? Look at Buse. Get hold of your father. Claire has cured his blindness. He can see. Huh? Yeah, I can see now. Time for me, oh. Hey, Mecca. You know, oh. Oh, sorry, oh. Hey. What are we going to do? I don't know. What is going on? Hey, Claire. I'll tell you what it is. Hey. Hey. Claire, Claire. I have an unfinished business with Ugobuz and Nato. And I need to do this alone. Okay, this Someone, Someone should go with hey. her now. Yes. Hey, hey, hey. I can't find her. Abala. Abala, I need your help. If you help me to find her, I will not only give you her blood, but the blood of all her family members. Abala, I will open up Amimu for you to come and fist on at will. Abala! Abala! Ugobuzo, I've heard you, but be warned. You have until nightfall to destroy her, or I will come for your life. Make no mistakes. You've had your chances of not coming back as a lesser being. Ha! Ha! You're not. Ha! Ah! Aleto! Hey! Hmm! Everything is getting clearer to me now. I've seen my daughter. Now I know why she came back in Gimba's house, yet you went back in search of her. Let me tell you, Ugobuzwe, the world will continuously resist evil like you. <laughs> and who is going to stop me? 
I was Otijim Olagu and I am still Otijim Olagu. You kill me first before you reach her or any other person. Come! Welcome home, my love. It's a good thing you are here yourself. To fulfill your destiny. Him? Too bad you were not here to witness me destroy Okotawala. Your father. Ugobuzu. When I hugged you, I thought it was love at first sight. Now, I know the truth. It was a continuation of our love in our previous life. But you never loved me. You wanted powers. Powers? You wickedly denied me. If only you were not so naive and stupid to realize you were in a covenant with an evil spirit and not the real up. Hey, hold it! Ibaralesia, <laughs> I don't want you to know I know so. He gave well, I go here. Oh, I go here. Oh, I go here. I As long as we always stand as one, good will always triumph over evil. In everything we do, in whatever you do, Never soil your hands with evil. <laughs> I am happy because peace has finally returned to our land. And I know you are equally happy. 
Eh? Because this peace is what will usher in progress into our land. Is it not true? Uh-huh. Um, um, no. You pass through a lot for something you don't know about. But you came out victorious. One thing that is very, very important is this. Family. Yes. Family is everything. Mm. Hmm? Family. Um, um, do they really need to know that you were Otuji Mbolobo, my father, in our previous life? I must not ask you how you got to know about it. Because a palm wine tapa does not say all he sees while on top of the palm wine tree. <laughs> yes. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> oh, Claire, I've been worried about you. I'm so sorry. Everything is fine now. Oh, it's okay. Mm -hmm. mm. <laughs> well, well, well. Now that Antonio Edeka has agreed to go with us to the city, I need to find out from Claire if she wishes to stay back in the village and continue. <laughs> <laughs> Young man. Young man. The most significant thing is that she has known her roots. And she has equally realized that her people are kind-hearted people. And that we are a poorly progressive people. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I want to take my leave. And I wish you all safe journey. Hmm? <laughs> yes. Odibendi, ya di porendi, ane se me loa, ya se ba kundi, ife di no erika, ay, ki imanka, imaze nankaza, dibe guaraza no amana saburu dibe, ay, Ah, where we die, my love and empty. Before we leave, there ain't no one to pack our chairs. No can I, I'm a runaway, a man who was a runaway. Oh, I'm a fool, can't deal with it, can't deal with it. It's better in a jail. I beg I see a man If a man is a Tara He won a man When he won It's a barrier and condition Sick of the light We are revolving like a second Oh, we're another It's a barrier and condition We're revolving around and around and around One way or another A fuck a mishaka A fuck it did the jawari And who the fuck I'm with I know the fuck I'm with Madu ba madu, chuku ba chuku. If I put a song in my mouth, I never will. The chicken, yummy, yummy, ah, ah. Okaram madu, okaram wa. I got run off, but I'm not. I better not make no one never will. O puso taisiana, eh, ay la barrio condesha. Seconds of life, we revolving around and around and around, yeah. 
is of a real condition. Seconds of life. We revolve around and round and round. Yeah. If I put in the red room, because I need to. If I put in the red room, because I need to. One day, my God, I am one of the other sons of Queen Anu. I'm a Renoir, 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 I'm a